Hello and welcome to my channel. In this video we are going to solve an example on lines and angles. In the given figure, line AB is parallel to the line DE. So let me just mark that these two lines are parallel. Find the value of x degree plus y degree minus z degree. So at this moment if you want to try it out yourself, you can pause the video. Okay. So here the given information is just that the line AB is parallel to the line DE. To understand and to get the value of the sum and subtraction of this angle, let me draw a straight line passing right through the point C and let it be parallel to the lines AB and DE. So I'm just going to draw a line like this and let me give it a name as CF. Now when I do this, the angle B and angle C, which is this angle, becomes the alternating angle of the lines AB and CF. So let me just show it to you how it becomes the alternating angle. Since I'm going to take these two parallel lines AB and CF and CB acts as a transversal line. Hence angle B and angle C becomes the alternating angles of these two parallel lines. Now CF is a straight line. And BC acts as a line intercepting the straight line. So this total angle is going to be 180 degree. So out of that we can see that here we have got the angle C as X because of the alternating angle. Therefore this remaining angle becomes 180 minus X. So let us keep it this way. Now let us look at the parallel line CF and ED. Now here angle Z at point D will be equal to the angle C and here also we will write it as Z degrees because of the alternating angles of the parallel line CF and ED intercepted by the transversal line CD. Now since here at point C we had an angle Y so angle Y becomes the total angle that is 180 minus X plus Z. So let us write over here y degree is equal to 180 degrees minus x plus z. So this is at point y. Now rearranging it and taking the letters on one side of the equal to sign, we get it as negative x comes on this side and it becomes positive plus y degree and plus z goes on the other side of the equal to sign and becomes minus z and this will be equal to 180 degrees. So we have got the value of x plus y minus c and that is equal to 180 degrees. So here we use the properties of the parallel lines to find out the value of the given angles. I hope you have understood all the steps and liked the video. And if you know any other way of solving this example, please comment below. And if you are liking my videos, like, share and subscribe to my channel. And thank you for watching.